Good morning, my friends. It's Ember, and it's time to check in with Spirit and my friends on the other side. Thank you, ancestors. Thank you, guides, for clear, distinct messages. <clears throat> Thank you, Spirit, for telling us what we need to hear today. Okay, let's dive right in, because today's message is super important. All right, so here's how it works if you're new here. Spirit gives me the messages. I go ahead and give them to you. I've got downloads coming in right now. And so I'm going to go ahead and start sharing. Now, all of these messages may not resound for you. Take what resonates with you, what feels right. Ignore the rest. These messages are timeless. You'll get them whenever you need to see this video. Trust me. <clears throat> That's the way spirit works. All right. So the message is here today. I'm going to tell you right now, take a look at yourself. You reckon yourself. Your habits are way, way, way out of control, whoever you may be. Your dependency on something is bad for you. I don't know if it's drugs. I don't know if it's alcohol. I don't know if it's having someone else take care of you. But I know the dependency in your life is way, way out of control, and you got to get it back into control. I'm shown that your habits are causing you issues, sleepless nights, lack of finances, arguments, disrespect. You have the power to change that if you want to. I really, really hope you want to. The next message Spirit is giving me is about contemplation. Go within to find your answers. Because when you do, everything will be clear. Especially about why you've got that habit. And it may be something more that you started out on the right path and then got stuck in a rut and stayed in that rut. But if you want completion, you've got to get rid of that habit. You've got to be really careful because right now you're surrounded by treacherous people. Somebody has got some bad things in store for you. They hate you simply because they can't. Don't let them dissuade you. Watch out for the treachery. I mean, it's not exactly staring you in the face. It's more subtle. But whoever it is, I'm going to tell you, they do not have your best interests at heart. And you know who it is. It's got to do with your habits. You go inside, you contemplate, you'll figure this out. And I know that you have a lot to do, but it's important that you get organized first. Spirit is saying you have to get organized. Once planning is complete, you can roll up your sleeves and then get to work. Your guardian angels surround you and are ready to help you out. Guys, I'm not sure if you have a very loving, kind, and loyal friend around you. Someone with a big heart, a quick wit, and an endless patience. I really hope so, because that person's going to help you. And if you don't, then maybe you'll meet someone, or you will adopt these traits within yourself, because this is what you're going to need to get through the treachery, to get through to completion, to get rid of your habit. You got to remember, that life is wonderful. Your hard work and dedication to your dreams will provide you with great peace and contentment. You got to get out of your own way first. Take time to enjoy the quiet moments, the reflection and leisure. Feel free to buy yourself small, luxurious gifts, guys. You've earned the financial security and the independence that you now enjoy. It's okay to reward yourself. There's nothing wrong with that. In fact, 
It's part of self-care, and I highly, highly recommend that. I am going to tell you, though, that the situation that you're in with your habits and the treachery requires emotional maturity and total trust. You've got to trust yourself, guys. Trust your instincts. I've been talking about it for the last couple of days. You're surrounded by those who have only the best of intentions most of the time. So you can rely on the advice that you're given. However, there are some that do not have your best interests at heart. And challenges will be resolved. Don't be afraid to depend upon yourself. Because you are generous. You are a humanitarian. And no matter what they say, you're not basic. You're refined. You're you. You're authentic. And it's okay. I mean, I get told I'm basic all the time. I just laugh at them. And I'm like, basically human? Yes, thank you. And those who know me just kind of laugh at that statement too. But I'm going to tell you guys, you have a lot of help surrounding you. You just have to get out of your own way. Go inside, do some reflection, some contemplation. Get out of that habit that's holding you stuck. Now, guys, never doubt that you can make a difference in the world. Your creativity and the ability to be innovative make you destined to succeed. Look, guys, honestly, it might be time to just expand your career. But don't forget to leave time for family or friends. This situation does involve another person. I know. But it's okay. Stand in your abundance. Stand in your intuition. Your, enforce those healthy boundaries for yourself. You're worth it. You really, truly are. Now, the last message Spirit is giving me here today is this. You have great courage and kindness within you even if you do not realize how strong and powerful you are. There's no problem you can't solve. The compassion you freely give to yourself and others must be given now to you. So stand strong in your convictions if the right answer is to tell someone no, even if that is to tell you no. Because remember, you're dealing with habits. Your angels have noticed that you've, you're not moving forward. You're stuck. You have multiple options that you're reviewing. And I think that might be part of the problem. You seem to be unable to choose. You're stuck. Maybe it's that habit and that contemplation we were talking about earlier. Ask your angels for some signs as what direction to take. Or just listen to that instinct inside you. Deep down, you know what to do. And you're headed to have a wonderful experience if you just get out of your way. It's going to be a total success. That project you're so stuck in your head over, it brings you awards, promotions, other recognition for your effort. Well done. If someone offers you help, take it. That's your angels going, hey, we're here to help you. We want to help you. We need to help you. Now, guys, one of the things here with habits, especially with negative habits and being stuck up in your head and stuck in a rut, you got to quit being hard on yourself. Turn your thoughts towards the positive. There's no need to worry. 
Anticipating the worst isn't helpful. Know that heaven will provide a solution for you if you're open to it. If you're experiencing sleepless nights or anxiety over a challenge in your life, give it to your angels. I promise they'll help you. They want to help you. They're ready to help you. They just need you to say, hey, I need some help here. So that habit that you're struggling with being stuck in your head, that treachery that is all around you, turn it over to the angels. They got your back, boo. If you need help, reach out to me. Contact information is below. If you need a new beginning, by all means, please. Let our step-by-step -step ritual kit help you. Because I promise new beginnings are waiting for you. You can be free. I know you want to be. I know you need to be. You get what everybody else gets. You get a life. How you use it is up to you. Be your best magical self ever. Remember, another message comes out tomorrow. Like and subscribe so you don't miss it. As always, go in love and light. Peace and progress. Ember out. <laughs>